So this question is a diagram question. Any question that provides some visual input, I'm going to call a diagram question. We see we have these dots here that represent data points. Um, we have an x-axis, we have a y-axis, so we always pay attention to that. Uh, so this question says, which of the following equations is the most appropriate linear model for the data shown in the scatter plot? All right, so if I were to draw a line through these points, it would look something like this. And that tells me that that line has a negative slope, right? It's going down and right, so negative. So then I should expect my answer choices to have a negative slope, which means C and D are gone. And just for a reminder, I'm thinking of Y equals MX plus B. Anytime I see the words linear model, linear equation, um, and where M represents the slope, B represents the Y-intercept. And based upon what I just told you, I'm basically saying that the M is negative. I haven't figured out exactly what it is, but it's negative. So that's why choices C and D are gone. Next, for my B value, which is the Y intercept, I see that my Y intercept for my red line that I drew should cross somewhere up here around positive 10. And I can see from between choices A and B, only B has a positive value in the um, B position, right? So answer choice B has a positive value in the B position for the Y equals MX plus B format of the equation of a line. So therefore, choice B is the better answer. Um, so hopefully you count that. I didn't really calculate any exact numbers. I'm just understanding the, the behavior of a line, right? I'm saying every line behaves based upon Y equals MX plus B. This line in red is a negative slope. So that get, got rid of C and D. And this line has a positive Y-intercept. So that got rid of choice A, only leaving choice B as the answer.